this shirt. Not more than fifteen dollars. Guess how much? It's one hundred thirty-eight dollars. This is nice. This I will give. Oh. This one. Six hundred thirty-five dollars. Are you kidding me? Hey guys, good morning. Welcome to another vlog video with Fabian. So today it's Christmas around Toronto right now, and we're gonna explore or the all the Christmas decoration in Toronto. So we're gonna go to the mall. We're gonna do maybe some Christmas shopping. So it's kind of like a Christmas shopping haul vlog. Um, we're going to the mall because it's very rainy outside, as you can see. So it's not good. It's not. Ideal. It's not ideal to be walking outside and enjoying nothing. Also, I just want to say thank you guys again so much for subscribing and liking our content so much. And I really, we really see the love. We, we see the love. Thank you so much. <laughs> Quick change. So here's my OOTD, guys. You know what? It took me five minutes in the closet <laughs> looking for the outfit that I was gonna wear today. And what else is new? I'm wearing all black. I didn't want to wear a lot of layers today. I know it's winter here in Toronto and it's very cold, but I didn't want to wear a lot of layers because we're gonna be spending time in the mall so guys before we go to the mall no I'm gonna show you the getting ready process because I've never really done a getting ready video <laughs> many of you are asking like what I do with my face why is it flawless is it even flawless I think it's just a good lighting I don't wear a lot of makeup I don't wear makeup at all so here's what I do when I get ready okay get into the bathroom the first thing I do is I wash my face sometimes I don't have my face so Long. Sometimes they go nasa sabon. Do you guys like it? I went clubbing last night. Um, so after that, I just wet my hand. And then I. So since I didn't wash it, there's still product in it from yesterday, and that's pretty much it. And then now, the only thing that I put is moisturizer. Hi, Fabio. Everything he's telling you is a lie. I'm, I'm telling the truth. Five minutes before work. <laughs> He runs like a mofo all around the house, waking me up every single morning. This is my getting and ready. And then he doesn't put any moisturizer because he's late all the time. <laughs> it's my getting ready. Sorry about that, guys. Usually before moisturizer, para hindi madulas, I put my contact lenses on. And that's it. So that's really everything I put on my face and that's all my getting ready part. But now I read somewhere that you're supposed to wear sunscreen every single day. So I try to wear sunscreen. I'm using this product and the moisturizer that I use is Aveeno. So let's put some sunscreen. That's really all my getting ready guys. There's nothing much. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to subscribe and comment down below. Beauty blogger. Since Fabio's wearing a bonnet, a beanie, a toque, I'm wearing a toque as well. So. He's wearing sunscreen, but he's not making the bag. Why did you change your outfit? Or do you prefer this? <sighs> no, I'm not wearing a toque because I know I'm gonna get hot. Yeah, that's fine, whatever. Time to go. Fabio, oh, give, us, give us a tour to your house. Welcome, guys, to my house. This is where I like to sit in the morning. Reading a book. It's a bit small this year, but fancy. <laughs> so guys, we're waiting for our Uber. In the meantime, I'm replying to you guys. And in the meantime, we're replying to your comments, replying to your messages on Instagram. There's a lot of them, and I'm sorry I can't get to all of them. I know, it's so hard. 99 requests. I actually got through all of them. You got through all of them? Yeah. And all of these comments or uh, messages are so sweet too, and I'm so happy. You guys really like our content. Thank you for the support. Today, when we get home later, we're gonna film Instagram rates of our subscribers again because you guys really like that and there's a lot of requests and asking us when we're gonna film that again it's Christmas here now guys there's a Christmas tree here in our condo guys we're here so I bet the mall is going to be so busy today because it's the weekend and everybody's Christmas shopping. Yeah. And but we're rainy. here! It's rainy out, it's ugly. Yeah, it's what people do. When it's rainy out, they always go to the mall to hang out. So first thing is we're going to eat. That's what we always do. And he but the washroom was close. <laughs> and you know when you get so close to it and it, it, you need to do it even more? Yeah. And now I'm like, I cannot keep it. Because you can't. Oh, 
Oh lord. To go, go, go pee. God. Oh lord. I'll wait out here, have fun. I'm not the gun, Fabio. But I'm not. What's taking you forever? Lunch time! Oh, you got I got ramen. Again. What did you get, Fabio? Something very healthy. Is it healthy though? I got. Oh, is it large? So we can share. <laughs> I got ramen, guys. Mm. This is a nice shot of you. Wow, Jan. Perrier water, like rich people. Is it good? Doesn't seem like it from your face. Having. You guys know the drill after food is coffee! Okay hey guys, let's play a game called Guess the Prices. We're at the <laughs> store right now. <laughs> We're at the store right now where it's all expensive. Okay, so this shirt is very basic, you know. It's very nice. Not more than $15. It, you can buy this at H&M Forever 21. Guess how much? $138. It's $138. It's not nice. This is nice. This I will give. Okay, let's look for more items. So we found another beautiful item here. This one. $635, are you kidding me? So obviously this store is not for us. <laughs> we don't belong here. <laughs> don't. So we're here in our final destination. This is what I really want to explore today. This is a very nice Christmassy vibe store. Wow. So now guys, we're in this kitchen section, my favorite part of all. Because it packs you on top of your pots. Oh my god, is the one that straight into this? Ah, uh, yeah. I think of it as you in a box. I want this one. Read the thing. I want to start smoking just because of this. What flavor do you want? Fried chicken? Jelly beef fried chicken? <laughs> In Christmassy. It smells like Christmas. Baby boy, what, what are you smelling now? Poutine? Durian candle. My head is aching now. Yanisa is indecisive. Indecisive. Hey guys, we just got back from the mall. And I have, I have some mini haul for you guys. Let's do a mini haul. We don't really do a lot of haul in this channel because we don't shop a lot. And we don't have a lot of money to shop for. And we don't have a lot of companies sending us stuff yet. But there's some. We'll be doing that soon. Stay tuned. So, I went to Bath and Body Works at the mall. As you can see in the video, it was very Christmassy, right? So, in the feeling atmosphere of Christmas, I went to buy some scented candles that are meant for Christmas. So I got two candles, only two because nothing crazy because they're so expensive. Um, I just, can we talk about it? I just realized how expensive candles are. I didn't really think much about it, but anyway. First one is I got White Barn Vanilla Balsam. When I smell this one, it just really reminds me of Christmas. I heard you're supposed to smell the lid instead of this. Mmm, it smells so good. It has like a very, it has a little bit of a foresty woody smell but it's very sweet as well because of the vanilla bean that's why it's called the barn white barn next one is what winter candy apple it's winter candy apple so as you can see it has some decorations with like christmas decorations and everything now this one is very very sweet obviously it has apple scent to it and it's just Refreshing. It's something about refreshing about it. So I'm gonna use this one. I'm gonna light this up. There it is. In about two or five minutes, the house is gonna smell like winter apple candy. 
winter candy apple. When winter candy apple. So we just got home from the groceries. Now I'm gonna cook pork adobo. <laughs> but here are the things that we bought. I'm gonna put them away first. So I don't really know what type of cut of pork you're supposed to buy in the market, and this is the only thing that's available in the market. So I'm using this. So we're gonna cut them into cubes pieces. I don't really know the re recipe. I looked at some recipe online, including Chris Aquino's cooking pork. So I'm gonna follow that. They said you're supposed to marinate it. The longer you marinate, the better it is, but we have no time. So in a bowl like this, we're gonna put all the ingredients in there together. Throw in the pork, garlic, I don't know the recipe, so I keep on. I'm gonna keep on checking Google. So here's what it looks like for now. So Google says soy sauce. Oh wow, that's a lot of soy sauce. So guys, it's marinating. It's right here. I'm excited. It's my, like I said, it's my first time. If I'm doing anything wrong, just comment down below. I don't know how to cook Filipino food. I know how to cook other dishes, but not Filipino food. So we'll see. So this is what we usually do in the weekends. We cook for our meal for the week so that we go to work, we have lunch to bring. I'm happy that Fabio is exper experimenting new food. And I'm also happy I'm experimenting new food, like the Filipino food. I know how to eat it, but I don't know how to cook it. This one is bacon. Oh, so I read that you're supposed to use pork belly for um, pork adobo. But I didn't see that in our local grocery store here in Toronto. I probably have to go for a butcher shop or something, or a fancier grocery store. We're also listening to Christmas music! Okay, so this should be okay. I'm not gonna wait for an hour to marinate this. So I'm gonna start cooking this first. Let's go heat up our pan. Wow, Fabio, what are you making? I'm making a great vegan dish, as you can tell. Vegan with bacon? Yum! Totally. Heat the pot and put in the marinade pork belly, then cook for a few minutes. Add water, whole peppercorn, and dried bay leaves, and then bring to a boil. You know when you don't use your brown sugar a lot, and it's like rock hard I think it's solid? Burning. This was burning before, so now you don't want to burn. Ayan the guys, I'm excited. Ayan na, na ya. So I'm cooking this here. And Fab is cooking this. Explain your dish, Fab. Nothing. I basically just put spinach and bacon and parmesan cheese and some milk and eggs in it. So Goro Loto na to. Ayan guys, thank you guys for watching. This is the final product. Thank you. Okay, so now I'm gonna add, I think, sugar, water, peppercorn, and bay leaf. Right? I don't know. Comment down below if you guys do it differently. Taho ng laurel, bay leaves. So Panlasang Pinoy said to simmer this down to 40 to an hour until the pork is tender. And now he's gonna make the third dish. My, I'm so proud of my boyfriend. So proud! We got all our spices, guys. You, can you tell that we love to cook? So for companies who want to send us some cooking stuff, baka nama. It's tender. I'm excited. My quiche mm. looks delicious. Fabio's quiche is done. It looks so good. He also made faro. Hey guys, it's time to add the vinegar. So they said, and Lasang Pinoy said, four tablespoons. Since this is my first time, I'm literally measuring it down to the core. Bonk. Does it taste bad? It's very salty. <laughs> really? Oh, I knew we were gonna go for salt. Oh my god. Too salty? We could add water. How much salt did you put? Did you follow the recipe? Yeah, I did. But I think I added too much salt. I shouldn't have added salt. It will balance it out because my salmon and my food is without salt. Okay, guys, dinner's ready. We're gonna close the vlog here because we're gonna enjoy the night, watch a movie, eat our beautiful dinner. Thank you for watching. Thank you, guys. See Please you next subscribe. Time. See you next time. Bye.